Hello and today we are counting the top 10 action adventure anime with a strong male lead. Number 10, Radiant. Nemesis, powerful, mysterious, demonic entities that fall from the sky and vaporize anything they touch. The only ones who can combat these creatures are sorcerers, those who have survived an encounter with a nemesis but were infected in the process. Seth, a sorcerer from Pompo Hills, sets out on an adventure to exterminate all these nemesis. Accompanying him are Doc, Melia, fellow sorcerers who share his ideal. The main objective is to bring about a world where soldiers are no longer persecuted for being infected and to that end decide to destroy the source of the nemesis themselves, the medical radiant. Number 9, Grimoar of Zero. In liturgical year 526, sorcery has spread throughout the land, but few are aware of a rival practice called magic. One day, a half-human, half-beast mercenary who has found himself on the run encounters a beautiful witch known as Zero. Zero makes him an offer. If he escorts her on the search for her stolen grimoire, she will help him gain a human form. Despite his hatred for witches, the nameless mercenary accompanies Zero and guards her as she sets out to reclaim a book that has the power to destroy the whole world. During their journey, his inner kindness is revealed as he starts to show compassion and sympathy towards humans and witches alike, and the unlikely companions grow together. Number 8, Sayuki Reload Blast. <laughs> Humans and yokai, science and magic, all exist side by side on a peaceful continent free of all order and regulation, widely known as Shangri La. The balance there was shattered when the minus wave caused all the yokai on the continent to rampage, an event known as the Calamity. Continuing their journey west to stop Guama's resurrection experiments, the root of all the evil on the continent, the three aspects are finally drawing closer to India. But the closer they get, the more pronounced the influence of the calamity becomes, and the more intense their battles become. Also standing before them is the tragic calm of 500 years past. Number 7. Tales of Sestria, The Cross Legends speak of the shepherd, a savior who will bring peace to the seraphim and human worlds. Sore has spent his life studying ancient books and exploring runes to learn more about the legendary savior. Then he and his seraphim companion, Mikleo, encounters a mysterious girl in the ruins. The stories of the Sephard become Sori's reality. But is he strong enough to take on the evil lord of calamity? Number 6, Suisei no Gargantia. <laughs> In the distant future, the human race is on the brink of destruction. Mankind, which now drifts in space aboard a massive technologically advanced base known as Avalon, is poised to launch one final desperate attack against its enemy. The alien race Hideoise, it's during this battle that Lido, a mecha pilot, is thrown into a wormhole and sent to an unfamiliar place. Earth, the lost birthplace of humanity said to have turned to ice long time ago. Lido must come to terms with these primitive people with their backwards language and technology, learn to communicate and try to find a way back home to his place in the sky. Number 5, Plunderer. Plunderer. Every human inhabiting the world of Alicia is branded by Count, or a number written on their body. 
Depending on how each person lives their lives, this count either goes up or down. For Hina's mother, her total drops to zero and she's pulled into the abyss, never to be seen again. But her mother's last words sent Hina on a quest to find legendary hero from the vase Va, the fabled ace. Number 4. Overlord <laughs> On the night, his favorite MMORPG is scheduled to be shut down. Veteran player Momonga stays locked in until the clock hits zero. The screen goes dark for only a few moments before he finds himself completely immersed in the world of Yggdrasil. Left with all his character's devastating powers, total dominion over his loyal NPCs, and nothing better to do, Momonga decides to try his hand at taking over the world. All the hours he spent grinding and dungeon crawling have certainly paid off, and as he tests his strength on a local Grogus and legendary beast, he becomes to realize that not one opponent can stand against his might. Embracing his new identity as the fearsome mage, ends all go. Momonga continues his search for bigger battle adversaries, leaving the people of Yggdrasil to wonder who exactly is trapped with who. Number 3. Dororo In Japan's warring state period, Lord Daigo Kagemitsu makes a pact with 12 demons, exchanging his unborn son for the prosperity of his lands. The child is born malformed and is set adrift in a river while Kagemitsu lands thrive as promised. Years later, young chief Dororo encounters the mysterious Hyakimaru, a boy whose arms are blades and whose visionless eyes seem able to see monster. Number 2. Katana Gatari Sword Story これまで戦った相手の中じゃ、それなりの上位に食い込むことになるだろうな。ジェリア。ああ。もうちょっと若く見えなくもなかったけれど。in the wake of rebellion that shook Japan 20 years prior, Togame Hida, general director and strategist for the army, seeks to obtain the 12 Deviant Blades, created by Master Swordsmith Sikizaki Kiki, to help add stability and security to the Bakufu government. Though aid this endeavor, she looks to enlist the help of Yasuri Muchine, head of the Kyoto Ryu school and hero of the rebellion. But when she arrives on the island where he lived in exile, she finds him dead, succeeded by his skilled yet slightly deaf son Shichika. Number 1. Shield Hero Four cardinal heroes are a group of ordinary men from modern day Japan summoned to the kingdom of Melromark to become its saviors. Melro Mark is a country plagued by the waves of catastrophe that have repeatedly ravaged the land and brought disaster to its citizens for centuries. The four heroes are respectively best out a sword, spear, bow, and a shield to vanquish this wave. Now Fumi Iwatani and Otaku becomes cursed with the fate of being the shield hero. Armed with only measly shield, Nafumi is belitted and ridiculed by his fellow heroes and the kingdom's people due to his weak offensive capabilities and lackluster personality. And that has been my countdown of a top 10 action adventure anime with a strong male lead. Hope you find something to watch and peace.